I'm here with uh, Brooke Rauber from uh, just outside of Syracuse, New York, who just won the 2020 Pan Am Cross Country uh, Cup U20. Uh, youth, uh, congratulations to you. Thank you very much. How does that sound to you, uh, 2020 uh, uh, Pan Am Cross Country Cup uh, gold medalist? It's unbelievable. It just still hit me. I'm just so proud of all my Team USA, and I want to thank like my coaches and my friends back at home too. One of your coaches is here, and that's your mom. Uh, she was cheering you on, as as was your dad, of course. Uh, uh, what does that mean to you to have your parents there uh, cheering you on up here in Canada? It means so much. They're always so supportive of me, and I just I just couldn't thank them enough. You're just 17 years of age. This is a U20 race. You're up against some 18 and 19 year olds. Uh, talk about your uh, fitness. You started running in grade seven. Um, uh, is this a life focus for you? Are you going to go to university perhaps uh, with a scholarship, do you think? Yeah, I definitely want to run D1 in college and hopefully continue that after that. But, yeah, I just have felt so fit um, during indoor. I'm also training for the 1500, which is at, I'm running it at States next week. So I've just been trying to balance both cross country and track. High school states, and uh, so what is your uh, personal uh, record in the uh, 1500? In 1500, um, I've run 428. Well, it's very solid for your age. Wow, good for you. Thank you. So uh, talk about this course. you got that diabolical hill that you've had to uh, ascend three times in the 6K race. Talk about uh, uh, you were in second place for a while there, and uh, were you just holding back and just seeing where your fitness is with the hill and that? Yeah, um, we've been working on a lot of hills, so I was kind of prepared for this, um, especially because I run in New York. I think that hills are really my strong suit. So this was a good, challenging course. I think it really showed who's in who's ready this is real cross country that's just for sure um yeah so i was in second most of the race i was just kind of seeing how i felt i knew that the um canadian was super good and super fit and i think sadie's her name yeah i was i was aware of her and she's a like amazing competitor and she's so good too so i was just waiting and feeling out the race as it went along yeah that was a legit uh win because uh sadie Six sixted who finished second to you uh, is a silver medalist at our nationals, so it was a very solid runner. So that was a great uh, race on your part. So talk about the venue and um, the city. You, your visitor here, obviously. What is your first impression of Victoria uh, and Langford, BC? Yeah, it's just so beautiful. It's I love everything about it, like the nature and everything is just so pretty. And this is like a perfect spot to run. Like we may be dying, but at least we're dying in a pretty place. So. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And then uh, let's just quickly uh, talk about university. The universities have been talking to you since September. Have you narrowed down where you'd like to go? Not really. I'm keeping all my options open. All right. Well, nice work here, and uh, good luck next week at States. Thank you.